we are back. Question number 11. Do you plan your life around your marijuana use? Well, <laughs> for those of us that are in the grips of addiction, the answer to this is absolutely yes. For me, the places I went, the people I hung out with, and the things that I did were 100% determined on whether or not I could get and stay high. So I wanted to, you know, hang out with certain people, but if I couldn't get and stay high in that group, I'd go to another group. If I wanted to do a project at school or whatever it was, if that was going to get in the way of me getting high, then I wouldn't do it. And as I got more and more in the grips of the addiction, more and more, I wouldn't even walk out of my house if I didn't know absolutely that I was going to be able to get and stay high. And as life gets busier and as you grow up and start becoming an adult and have real life responsibilities, man, life can get really painful and really mischievous and you start to manipulate situations. All kinds of really unhealthy behaviors start happening when you have to plan your life and control everything around you so that you can get and stay high. And the amount of anxiety and paranoia and all kinds of really yucky feelings start to become your normal experience because you're trying to control so many things, manipulate everything and find a way to make the world work the way you want it to work and also ensure that you can be high all the time. So. Question number 11 again, do you plan your life around your marijuana use? If yes, or if you can see that being part of your daily life, you may want to ask yourself if this is a problem for you. 